VSA warning light. Welcome back to Top 5 Auto Repairs. How do you fix a VSA warning light that won't turn off? The purpose of VSA, which stands for Vehicle Stability Assist, is to help driver to not oversteer and understeer when turning around the corner. So when a driver turn left or right or around the corner, this will ensure that the driver will make a smooth turn. When the VSA warning light stays on, this means that the system is disabled and the driver no longer have that vehicle stability assist to help make a smooth turn. When VSA is disabled, the driver needs to be more cautious when making turns. For example, the driver may oversteer or understeer, and when the driver is either turning left or right, the vehicle may start to skid and slide. Driver also needs to be more cautious, especially when road condition is very poor, for example, gravel road or icy road or when it's raining and so on. So how do you know when you have a problem with your VSA system? For example, if the VSA light turn on and it starts to blink, that means it is working. However, if the light stays on, that means there's a fault somewhere in the system and I'll tell you what that fault may be. In order for the VSA system to work properly, it's going to need multiple inputs. So the most common problem is going to be a faulty wheel speed sensor that may not be working properly. You may have a faulty ABS control module, you may have a bad ABS pump, and so on. If your VSA warning light is on, the ABS warning light is on, and you're getting wheel speed sensor code, maybe this might be the issue. So here's the wheel speed sensor over here. What you want to do, you want to make sure you check the connection. You want to make sure there's no damage. You want to make sure the, uh, the wheel bearing is working properly. You also want to make sure that the reluctor on the axle is not dirty because if extremely dirty, then the wheel speed sensor cannot get a proper reading from the reluctor. Also, you want to remove the wheel speed sensor and check for metal shavings that's on it and also dirt that may be on it because that might actually interfere with the signal and cause the uh, VSA warning light to turn on. The next common problem is going to be a faulty steering angle sensor. So the steering angle sensor purpose is to calculate the rate of turn. If the steering angle sensor is faulty and it cannot, cannot calculate the rate of turn, again, this is going to trigger the uh, VSA warning light. The next common problem is going to be low tire pressure. If tire pressure is low, this is going to cause the wheel to turn at different speed. So if you notice the TP MS light is turning on and the uh, VSA warning light is turning on, Maybe just adding air into your tire to the proper uh, pressure may actually fix the issue. If you decide to proceed driving with the VSA system disabled, you need to be more careful when driving on poor road condition. Again, such as gravel road, slippery road, when you're making a turn, when it's raining, and so on. I hope you found this video useful. As always, thanks for watching and subscribe to Top 5 Water Repairs.